guys, Mish Mama here. So this channel is all about KDP Amazon find, finding those golden nugget niches. And if you're about that and you're excited about that, this channel is for you and I welcome you, okay? <laughs> and I have kids. That's why, that's why I'm the Niche Mama. So today's video, I'm going to be giving away two sub niches under one niche, and that's joke books for kids. Um, I think this, these are really, really great sub niches. Um, I think you guys are going to love this, and I actually don't really want to share it because I've put books from myself, like I've published some books under um, a few of these joke books. Um, yeah, so you guys, you're welcome. <laughs> so stay tuned because I have a little gift I'd like to give away to one person at the end of this video so watch this entire video to know how you could win this prize and what it is okay guys um, this is my youtube channel um, I don't know if you know this but if you want more niches just subscribe to this channel <laughs> okay so moving on this is the best idea that I had in a long time and it's a knock knock jokes book the reason why I'd say it's really really good is look how many people are searching for it each and every month and it's not even Christmas yet you know what I mean so so yeah Christmas would bring this way higher so the first one is knock knock jokes for kids uh, 46 and it has 344 results 49 as a keyword niche score this next one is knock knock jokes for kids um, it had a 46 niche score um, just scroll through and get ideas. Look at how many reviews are on this. Um, some of these covers I don't really like. So yeah, you can definitely um, do better. Like that one. And it was just published, but it's sponsored and the cover's not very good. Um, in my opinion. Sorry. Being honest. But anyways. So the next one is Knock Knock Jokes for Kids 7 and 9. And it had a 57 niche score for 370 search results an average of one, 138,000 which is underneath 300,000 which is what we want to see okay so let's go to the next joke book would you rather joke books um yeah it's really like there's so many people searching for this already and it's got low competition like look at this the would you rather book for kids ages 7 to 13 has 46 46 niche score and only like a little bit over 300 competing products and and when I searched into helium 10 it showed me and I think I'm going to scroll back up in a second I'm just showing you the covers um just to get different ideas of what people like you know what stands out to people I think the dog with the smile would definitely stand out to me to buy for my kids and the yeah the dog there like that's really cute and a great idea people love seeing funny looking animals as covers seems to be pretty popular yeah uh, and then some of these covers i don't really like but anyway so yeah 308 search results for the would you rather book for kids ages 7 to 13 now let's see how many people are searching for it See, 2,499 people are searching for it. And if you want to do Christmas, here's Christmas as an idea. Because Christmas is coming up. And either way, you guys, Christmas coming up, they're going to buy any Would You Rather book. Or be looking for any Would You Rather book. So the next niche, or the keyword is Would You Rather book for kids. And a 53 score. Low competition of 300 competing products. 1,877 people are searching for that keyword each month. So next is the Would You Rather books. 59 score, 761 search results, and yeah. Scrolling down if you want. Um, I'm not going to bore you looking through every single one, but it looks really good in my opinion. Um, so we're going to go to a different keyword here. The Would You Rather books for kids 8 to 12. Um, I'm going to go ahead and click that. And 338 search results. And on the Helium 10, I'm going to show you guys something really, really cool in just a second. So I'm going to show you guys this really cool graph in just a minute here. 
um, for helium 10. That's why I really love helium 10. So here's the graph. You click on it and it shows you how many people are searching for it right now versus the whole year round. Like right around Christmas right here. That's the highest peak. And November it rises. October is when it starts to rise. October 30th. That's really great to have it before Christmas. Okay, you guys. So if you're going to get these books out, get them right now. This is a perfect time. Um, and yeah, just have a look through, find out different other keywords because there's lots of keywords you could use. And you know what? You can look at them now versus a few weeks from now and see how they rose up in search volume. And you could even do Easter right now if you really wanted to. Um, these Would You Rather joke books, I think, are going to be so popular right around Christmas. So the next one is Would You Rather books for kids. I don't know what just happened there. There we go. 546 search results. Let's see what the keyword niche score comes to be. 59. That's really good. Yeah, all the Would You Rather books I've seen are like, what I would do. So you can see this keyword here that it also peaked at around Christmas time. Very, very popular around Christmas because they're like great stocking stuffers, right? Okay, you guys, thank you so much for watching. So if you guys watched the entire video and you're watching this now, um, get excited because I'm going to be giving away 500 Would You Rather jokes to one person, only one person, because if a bunch of people have the same jokes, it's going to be a little bit complicated on Amazon for us, right? So, yeah. So, if you guys um, want to enter to win, all you got to do is comment below this video and say, I would love to win the 500 um, jokes. So, go ahead and do that now. And I'm going to pick one, one winner. So, yeah. So, you guys, until next time. Niche Mama, tune in out.